Welcome back to another travel video. This time we are going to explore the island of Mararison. Mararison is a small island and is one of the barangays of Colase Antique. The island is best known for the following. Mini Batanes Hills, the gorgeous sandbar, the wild pitcher plants, and the beautiful coral gardens surrounding the island. All of this we are going to show you in this video. But before we proceed, make sure that you subscribe to the channel and follow my social media accounts. Make sure to hit that bell button so you'll get notified every time I upload a new video. <laughs> To start our journey, we will be starting in Iloilo City. It will be a 5 hour drive to Kulasi Antique, where it is the jump off point going to Mararison Island. From Iloilo, we are going to Sibalo, where we are going to stop to eat our lunch. Then after that, another two and a half drive going to Kulasi Town. Once there, we will get a boat and then ride to the island. All the details will be on the video so make sure that you watch until the end. Have fun and enjoy my travel vlog to Mararison Island. Hey guys, I'm here at St. Crox. Sibalom. We're gonna have lunch here because we're going to Kulasi after this. Eh, masarap yung ano, pizza nila dito. Let's go! <laughs> Thank you, good sir. <laughs> good work to Alome. Pagdating nyo sa tourism office, which is near the sea wall of Colase, doon nag-aabang yung mga bangka. Magbabayad kayo ng 10 pesos terminal fee and then 20 pesos environmental fee. Tapos, yung bangka naman is 1,000 pesos which is good for up to 5 persons. Back and forth na po yan and if you have a car or a motorcycle, you can safely park it in front of the tourism office. Okay. Tapos ang jasaman sir, bali by dan yung jasaman, environmental na 20, kung terminal natin, bali 30 per. 30 per head? Okay. Ang 1,000 na sir, pwede mo na nga pagbalik lang ang mga pagbayan nyo sa bootman ay Ate, okay. Sige, pwede mo. Sir, mag-back and forth ng 1,000. Okay, sige, sige, sige. Dog, mga nag-female, kuya. Pila ang parking fee, boss? Diretso siya, maalang, sir. Ah, sige, sige. May contact mo mo, sir, sa Purugan. Oo, oh, meron. Sa Blue Lagoon kami maan. Oh. Okay, 
So, dito tayo i-plastar, boss. Ang sa... Okay, okay, okay. Okay na. Okay na. Are, boss, o. Oh. Are lang, o. Oh. Doa. Ah, okay. Sige, sige. Pilang na, boss. Pilang dua? Tupinti pila nagkaka ano tanan? Rockfish. Kilon na natong. Nagkumak lang ni sir tawag para i-serve lang diyan ito kuong ko lang. Eh ay sana naman. Ti pila na? Okay pa na boss no? Sige bigi liwa be. Medyo malakas ang hangin sa seawall. Kaya medyo nahirapan kaming umakyat sa bangka. Pero sabi ni Manong, kalmado naman daw ang dagat at walang malaking alo. Timingan mo, Park! <laughs> yeah. Thank you! Finally arrived at the famous Mararison Sandbar. Walang tao or walang nagsiswim during that time kasi Friday kami pumunta ng hapon. At around 4 p.m. na. We went straight into the information cottage and then naglista ng mga pangalan namin. We've also asked if we can get a guide to take us to the Lantawan Hill where you can see a 360 view of the whole ah, island. Ay, kilala nyo pang ano? Okay na. Ang um, resibo? Oo. Okay na. Sige. <laughs> Woo, let's go. Siyempre, ihahatid muna namin yung mga gamit sa resort. The resort where we are going to stay is the Blue Lagoon Resort. Marami ring mga homestay dito sa isla na pwedeng i-rent within the community itself. So if you're planning to do a DIY trip to Mararison, then makakamura ka if you are going to a homestay. Swabe. Warm up hiking. <laughs> oh, guide hiking. Pawiwai lang lang. Makape lang. Makape lang kami. <laughs> Suwabe kay H plus ng signal. <laughs> si Malan mo na eh. Gawin ko pang agat ni Park. Amanin ko Paul Roma mo. Hindi uh, niya air ko no? Okay guys, so nito na kami sa room. Good, good for four. <laughs> Pero may kasama na si R. Ah, okay na mag-report. Okay, 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 mag na Marison, the so-called Batanes in Marison. Yeah. <laughs> so let's go. 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 So pagkatapos Hello. naming magkape, <laughs> we started our hike to Lantawan Hill. Sa hike na ito, you will encounter the famous pitcher plants of Mararison. Bakit po big deal ang pitcher plants? The tropical pitcher plant 
is endemic to the Philippines. Endemic meaning native or restricted lang yung mga areas kung saan sila tumutubo. Kaya, if you are here in Mararison, take the chance to take a photo with the pitcher plants. Picture to the perch. Oh, picture to the prey. You will also come across settlements within the island and the school. Masisilayan mo ang part ng island life dito sa Marison Island. Hindi naman po gaano kastip yung mountain climb. A lot of old people are going up here. That is because you can see a lot from the top. And kung suswertehen ka, you will see Mount Majaas in its full form. Guys, bali ito yung tinatawag na picture plants. So, very rare na plants to. Usually dito lang daw makikita sa ano, sa isla. Sa ibang isla naman, sa tabing isla wala wala daw nito. Bali na si Drew. Kaya yan. Dako na. Gising gising na yun. Sunda lang ah, matingog pre! <laughs> Tingkit lang help. Amo na natabos ang San Enrique. Ano na? Ah, morning. Ano naman? Ang nakaka-radio ra to. Ang battery ka radio. Ah. Ipa to. Woo! Hey guys, so nandito na kami sa highest peak ng Marison Island. Ayan yung sandbar. And then, at my back, Mount Majaas. Nagpapakita na yung Mount Majaas. Walang cover na clouds. As in, makikita mo talaga yung shape niya. Ayan. And then, at my back, nakita nyo naman, sunset. Naganda ng sunset dito. So, if you're after sunset, go up here at around 4.30. 
kasi it's around 30 minutes lang naman yung ano yung um, akyat dito <coughs> and then it's all worth it sa mga hindi gusto mapagod pa akyat once in a lifetime lang na experience to makita nyo yung madyaas makita nyo yung buong kulase ano parang 360 degrees na ano view dito sa taas so ayan and then syempre doon Batbatan Island ayan so first time ko actually makat dito so uh, sunset 360 degrees uh, view tapos full view ng Madyaas and then yung Batbatan so ayan um, we're gonna go back to the resort sa Blue Lagoon kami nagbook ng aming rooms and then kung tatanungin nyo may signal ba dito sa ano sa Maririson yes pero dito ka sa taas <laughs> actually may signal kami doon sa baba sa so may Blue Lagoon pero medyo mahina H plus lang yung signal namin so ayan so kita kita tayo doon sa baba we're gonna chill cook dinner and then uh, we'll see what we can do tonight let's go Arigali pre oh mga bakal tadi eh. Oo. Evening. Ano? Bugas. Tista na sarang bold egg boss. Pila ka kamatis kinala ng takay pila ka ano. Okay na para sa to. Blue lagoon ma'am. Galuto ka po pa ma'am. Oh. Kaya kung magpalaha, pwede. Ah, okay. Ah, magpaloto, pwede. Sige mama, thank you. Oh. So pagdating namin sa resort, kumain, tumambay, nagkwentuhan, at nagrelax na. Para bukas, may energy na kami para mag-dive or mag-snorkel. Kakadla man sa doon, di man sa ano. Ganda dito Sa amin lang yung resort Walang tao Bukas pa yung mga tao Pero hindi namin alam kung ano Ayan Walang music or mga tao Kami lang Narinig namin yung ano yung splash ng wave so very relaxing. So ayan, chill lang kami dito until antukin kami and then tomorrow we're gonna dive. Samahan ko nila pag snorkel sa tatlong areas dito sa ano Marisol Island. So good night, see you guys tomorrow. Okay guys, so yan, tapos na kami kumain Dito na yung ano Sundo para sa snorkel Oo pre, may love jacket Boss, may love jacket, kabumbos no? So So yan Mag-base mo na ako pang dive Hehe, let's go Oh. Uh. 
clear na tubig No waves, no wind Kalmado yung tubig sabi ni Manong So ideal para sa dive, let's go Yung first na punta natin is yung mini cave ng Manarison Yung mga boya na tinuturo ko ay palatandaan na may dive site sa area. Yung first dive site namin ay nasa baba lang ng Lantawan Hill kung saan kami ay nag-climb kahapon. Super clear ng tubig. Problema lang, hindi pa mataas yung araw. Kaya medyo madilim pa sa ilalim. Of course, be careful of the jellyfish. Ang area na to is composed of big rock formations. May mga cracks where you can swim through and it's very ideal if you are fond of doing aura with these cracks. Further sa gitna, merong parang Grand Canyon where biglang nagda-drop into a much deeper area. There is not much to see here except for little fishes and yung parang tinatawag ko na taco corals. Medyo tulog pa yung mga isda during this time. Maliba na lang sa isang ito. This is by far the biggest puffer fish na nakita ko. dive site is yung malapit sa sunbar. Nakamark ulit siya ng pink na buya. Iba naman ang ibibigay ng area na to. Halos walang rock formations. Pero patong-patong yung mga corals dito at magkakadikit pa. Merong mga corals na parang tower yung shape. At may mga corals na parang Christmas tree. And syempre, if maraming corals, marami ring mga isda. On top of the corals are where the small fishes are. They tend to stick to the corals for protection. Dito talaga ako nag-enjoy. Pero maliliit pa rin yung mga isda. I got the feeling na parang overfished yung Mararison Island.
our time has come to an end and it's time to go back to the resort to pack our bags. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the resort again, Blue Lagoon Resort. <laughs> Kakatapos na namin magdive, ang ganda ng tubig. We're just lucky that it's this clear and the visibility is amazing. Grabe, the weather is really amazing today. No strong winds. No strong currents, no waves whatsoever. So yeah, nakabis na ako, nakapaglipet. Kasi approximately 12 uh, noon, babalik yung mga kadi ito. They're gonna fetch us, then bring us back to the mainland of Colase. Ayan. Um, maybe it's time that I show you yung resort kung saan kami nagstay. Okay, let's go. dito na lang yung video natin for Mararison Island. This is our first day here on our weekend adventure. Ngayon, we're gonna go back to uh, Kulasi because we're gonna go to our next destination which is Aningalan. Bagong resort, merong swimming pool sa taas ng bundok ng San Remejillo. So, if you are in Panay Island or in Antique, spending your summer, check Mararison Island out. Very good for snorkeling, free diving, scuba diving, as well as hiking on the mountains with uh, spectacular sunset views and especially the view of the sandbar from above. And you get to see Mount Majaas, the highest peak in Antique province. So make sure that you subscribe to the channel and then follow our social media accounts. Part 2 of our weekend adventure, punta kami ng Aningalan, that's today, so watch out for that. Ride safe, travel more, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!